Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is gonna be a little haul. I haven't actually done shopping in a very long time, which I'm actually proud of myself about because I've saved so much money, but I don't know. I have a few bits that I'm gonna share with you today. Um, just from like random places, well not random, but different places. So we've got Primark, I think H&M, um, Pretty Little Thing, Boohoo. So we are just gonna jump straight into it. Before we do, if you are watching this and you're not subscribed, then please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and also the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a video. We are just gonna get into it. Before we do, new hair guys. What are we thinking about my new hair? I've never had curly hair, long curly hair um, or anything like that. So I'm just one to stick to what I know. But I was contacted by this brand right here. I'm gonna butcher the name. Uh, Kaleyi. Um, this brand right here. Um, and they kindly sent me over three barn doors and a closure. I actually don't have the closure in at the minute because I, I done it, but I just felt so uncomfortable. But that's just me, I'm not used to like wearing closures and wearing wigs and stuff so i didn't want to just have it in just for the sake of it and feel uncomfortable the whole time that it was installed so i ended up just uh going back and just getting a regular leave out with the bundles and i'm super happy i feel so much more confident and comfortable with just using the bundles instead of the actual closure um but that's just my personal thing like if you guys are into closures and frontals and i'll definitely recommend that but for me i'm just more of a bundles leave out type of person hopefully maybe next year i will try and do like a wig or something like that but anyways um so this is the hair that they sent me i'm gonna leave on the screen like the hair texture because literally when i was getting it done my hairdresser was just like wow like where is this hair from what is this curl called like everyone in there was really nice and complimented my hair and said it looked so good and they loved the curls and stuff and i am obsessed with it like i've never had curly hair so this for me is something new but i'm happy that i've tried it out because i want to try curly hair in brown blonde like every single color now so yeah i'm really really happy with it and this is the hair kind of just washed and um just air dried i haven't really put any products in it just at the top to kind of blend my hair in so i have like minimal leave out and then obviously i have my edges and i've just slicked them down i've done a little swirly well she done a little swirly for me and i've kind of tried to recreate it again because i just think it looks really cool it just reminds me of like back in school days but um yeah i'm really happy with it like look how long it is i've never had dark hair as well like dark hair is um something new for me as well so i'm just loving it like it is so beautiful it doesn't shed a lot like you won't just be like a dog does a dog shed i don't know some type of animal anyway that just sheds a lot um so don't need to worry about that like this is the color that it came as well i think this is kind of like what a 1b or something so it's just like a natural kind of brownie black absolutely love it guys you guys will probably will definitely see different hairstyles for me because i do want to try like the curly wet look and i have my hair sewn in a way that i can kind of like pull it back and just try out different styles so um yeah i'm so happy with it and thank you to kalahi 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 for sending me the hair i am very very grateful super happy with it i definitely would recommend you guys checking out their website they do have like bundle deals um frontal wigs i think they do closure wigs as well i'm not don't quote me on that one but they do sell closures just loads of good offers on there at the minute so i'm gonna link the hair that i have down in the description box i definitely want to do like another separate hair video and show you guys like how i actually blend my leave out if that's something that i don't know you guys want to see like how i blend the ings i feel like i've done a pretty good job of it 
like blending into curly hair so um let me know if you want to see a video on that and then i'll show you guys the products that i use and how i do stuff and all that good stuff but yeah guys i'm so excited for this hair like look how long it is like i've never had hair this long before so yeah um i guess this is my christmas hair going into 2020 and all of that so yeah i'm really excited about it but yeah definitely check out the company and let's get into this fashion haul because i know that's what you guys are here for as well so um what where are we going to start okay i'll start with pretty little thing because there isn't really that many things but um i've been seeing this coat around in the black version and i kind of went on to get the black one but then i saw this color and i thought oh this looks beautiful so it's just kind of like a faux leather it's more like a tan color a dark tan what do they call it a tan yeah okay so it's a tan color and then it has this really nice tie waist i think it would look really good with like straight leg jeans and a pair of boot heels so that's the kind of vibe and how i want to wear it so i really love the detail of like the lining of the sheer shirling rather the shirling around the front just really cool um it also has it on the cuffs of the sleeves as well like i just absolutely love it i got this one in a size 10 because i didn't want it to be too small so i do still want it to be a little bit oversized so i can really tie it in at the waist and have that kind of body silhouette so i got this little top from pretty little thing looks tiny it's just like a knitted bandeau and i missed out on the one that they were doing in zara so i saw that pretty little thing was doing it and i wanted to pick up this cream yeah cream color they had it in black and grey, I think. And the way that they styled it is like they had it with a white shirt and kind of this, just like here, the shirt underneath, like tucked in underneath, like oversized. It just looked really, really cool. So that's how I want to wear this. I got this one in a size 8, well, size small, because I did want this one to be quite fitted. So then when I do wear like an oversized shirt with it, it would look, you know oversized and fitted so yeah i picked up that the next thing that i got is this gorgeous top oh it's so so pretty so um it's just like a it's not even a corset what would i call this oh look at that oh my god i think it's a little bit washed out on the camera but it's a really nice like champagne gold it's just so gorgeous so it kind of just sits like this it's got all the rouge and detail which is really flattering this part is actually boned as well so it actually does um stand up nicely then the sleeves are kind of just like draped on your arms right there got this one in a size 10 okay so next i got this jacket i don't know if you guys have seen this on instagram i've seen a few girls wearing it and it's just a denim jacket with this beautiful faux fur collar and uh cuffs on the sleeves as well now this one i got in top shop concession um from a brand called navy london and this was 145 pounds so if you do want this coat don't buy it from there <laughs> i know like there's different brands online that actually sell them for about 80 pound which is still good but guys if you can wait for like three weeks then get on aliexpress <laughs> because i'm literally about to go on aliexpress now and reorder this jacket because on aliexpress it's 30 pounds and it, of course it's from china so it takes a little bit longer but i'm hoping it will come here in like two weeks or so so and it will be like the same i'm pretty sure like all these companies are just selling the same coat but at different prices so i paid 145 pound for it because that's just where i saw it and i just wanted it but um don't follow me so i will leave links of other places that are cheaper than this one i will leave the link for aliexpress because aliexpress is 30 pounds 30 pounds and these people are selling it for 145 don't get conned like I did. So first up from H&M is this bag right here. You guys know I love a good mini bag. And I saw this in this beautiful green colour. And I was just like, yes. Like, I will add that to my collection. Like, so I'm just going to probably hold it like this. Or you do have, like, the strap. I'm sure I saw a strap. Yeah. 
Oh, it's a gold strap. You have a body cross body strap, which mm, I'm hoping that won't be too long. Um, but yeah, it's just so pretty. Like you can see the green. It's just a, a really nice dark, deep green. This one was 19.99, so I feel like a good price for a nice little mini bag. And then I got this jumper. So it's just, oh, you can't see anything. It's just a really nice, fluffy, soft, oversized knit jumper. I got this one in a size medium and it was $24.99. I just thought it would look really nice just with a pair of jeans, this oversized, even with my green bag just thrown over it, Christmas vibes. I actually don't have lots of things in Primark. I'm actually really upset because I wanted to do a Primark haul, but there's really nothing in there to buy. So I would just be buying stuff for the sake of it, but... I picked out a few things. So this is the first thing that I saw and it's just a checked woolly type of um, oversized shirt slash jacket. Um, I have worn this already. I got it in a size medium, which says it's a 12 to 14. I want it to be kind of oversized and quite slouchy, just kind of like thrown on. Um, I have worn it with a pair of jeans and a black crop top. I've seen a lot of people wear this kind of style jacket with like tracksuits and stuff and it just looks so cool. So yeah, um, I really liked the colour of the check as well. So it's kind of just like a grey with like an orangey brown um, colour running through it. So really, really like that. So I got this coat in a size 10. It was £30 and I actually don't have a black coat. Which is so weird. Like a, a smartish one that looks like this. Um, I don't know. I really don't have one. So yeah, I saw this and I thought I'd get it and see. I'm going to show it to you guys on. Let me know what you think. Should I keep it? It's a good price. Um, I think it is. And I just want to wear it just like casually. Um, hoodie, jeans, trainers, that kind of look. So we're going to see what this one is saying. So I got a scarf, this is actually from H&M and it was in the sale, it was £17.99 but it's gone down to £9 and it's just a really nice like beigey nude vibe check scarf. I don't usually wear scarves, I really don't wear scarves but it looked really good so I thought I'd get it and maybe it would look nice with that black coat so um, yeah. I was kind of trying to be practical with this and try, like thinking to keep warm but yeah I'm not really a scarf kind of girl so we're gonna see if I can fit this in. In new look I got this pair of tracksuit bottoms. This one I got in a size 10 it was $15.99 and it's just kind of like in a sand oatmeal colour and I don't know I'm kind of slowly getting into tracksuits and I'm kind of liking this whole shirt and tracksuit type of look. So I kind of got this to wear with this uh, shirt, which I'll talk about in a bit. Um, I've kind of liked that look and I feel like it was a look in summer, but <sighs> I'm a bit slow. So yeah, we're gonna see what it looks like anyway, but um, yeah, I'm kind of liking that whole tracksuit and a shirt type of vibe, so. We gonna see. So this is the last thing that I got from Primark. This shirt right here that I'm wearing. And it's just an orange and like navy check shirt. I actually got this one. I think it's either a 16 or an 18. Because I wanted it to be really oversized. And even, it's not even that oversized. Like if I'm completely honest with you. You guys will see it when I stand up properly. But um, yeah, I think this shirt comes up small anyway. Because on me, like this would be a good fit. Like I wouldn't really say like this is super oversized or anything like that. So yeah, um, but I liked it. I like it. I think it will go good with the pair of tracksuits that I got. Hoping, fingers crossed. So that is everything that I wanted to share with you. Those are all the bits that I've picked up so far this month. Like I said, I haven't really been doing that much shopping, which for me is really, really good. And I'm proud of that. So yeah, hopefully maybe Christmas sales, you guys will start seeing more videos and hauls coming through. But for now, I'm trying to save. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Make sure you are subscribed and follow me on my social media accounts. And I will catch you 